Hi everybody, Riley here for another episode of Fish Keep in Jamaica. Welcome to my channel. Okay, so today I talk about the whole idea of using water conditioner. I did a video similar to this before, but now I'm being practical. Um, it's a personal thing with me um, why I don't use um, water conditioner for my fish tubs. Okay, now uh, I have over 28 different uh, systems running at any one time, right? That means 25 28 uh, containers and one well 27 containers and one aquarium uh filled with fish right at any one time now should in case i let's say i have decided to do some water change right um significant water change in my system now that would be an issue because i would have to first purchase water conditioner that is not cheap uh to get enough water conditioner so as to change let's say two of my 250 gallon tote i would need probably about uh nearly four thousand dollars jamaican uh you would say that's about probably about 35 36 36 um us dollars right to change just two right and i have six right so therefore to change the entire set of water and that's like every week every other week right I would need roughly about uh, 300 US dollars to buy enough water conditioner to change my entire system so as to allow my fish to be in a clean environment. So what do I do? Now I have a, a thousand gallon uh, tank on the top of my house, right? The thousand gallon tank, it does work in that, in that uh, water is caught in it, but instead of, uh, I did a video the other day on that, instead of using the water, let's say two or three days after and what have been caught in it i tend to use it uh, a week or more after because of a uh, accident that happened a few weeks ago where which i actually used water about three or four days after it was filled two thousand um one thousand gallon right of water i used it and all of my fish in that tub died right because the water had some trace of chlorine in it still after about four days right um so uh it actually changing my water what i tend to do right now i tend to uh, always have two or three of my tubs empty right so therefore if i'm changing water in let's say my mangano um tub right what i would do i would uh release all the water take out the water and uh take out the fish place into a tub as already set up there that the water is already uh what call it fish safe and i will place the fish in that Right, and the fish will stay in that for about two weeks right meanwhile what i did i did a deep cleaning of the one in which the fish is coming out of and then i would use the tap water catch water place it in that tub i have to stay there for a bit if i find that i'm not using that tub for a very long time i would just get some of my um mosquito fish drop in that and that solve my problem with mosquitoes or any stray insect which might seek to abide in, in in that tub right and that's how i do it because if i try to get uh products to make my water uh fish safe um it's gonna be really expensive on my end oh with regards to uh my ibc toad no that can't work for my ibc toad right so what i have to do with my ibc toad i have to ensure that i have enough water sitting in the 1000 gallon um tank on the top of my house for about two or three weeks i have to ensure that enough water is in it before I, I i think about changing water as i said before i changed water the other day and uh i lost about 10 fish because traces of chlorine uh was found within the the, the um the this the thing right what happened is that uh with the with the with the, with, with, with the tank on the top of my house up having water all the time right there's a build up of uh i call it chlorine i don't know if it's chlorine or some something other stuff some little white stuff in the in the water um in the in the water tank right so um when the water is there sitting there for about three or so days that white stuff helped to add more um chlorine or some something to the water so as a result the water is not um fish safe um within two three days it have to be like probably about a week right before i can actually use that 
right and right now i'm experiencing a little issue regarding my tank on the old stop it's it's leaking i need to fix that so um thank you very much for stopping by this is was just a you know a share explain to you how i do water change right now as it is uh quarantine look no haircut for a long while peace catch it next time bye bye